Uh, my name is Christiane and I'm the program manager of our program informatics here in Venlo. Francis Venlo is a relatively small campus, which is quite nice because it's uh, a personal oriented uh, education. And an another advantage of being here in Venlo with all the companies around is that we have a good contacts to companies and thus have a quite education that is related to business life. Informatics is the field of developing software for a variety of cases uh, that are necessary. And within that field of informatics, you can distinguish between those people who focus on really designing and implementing coding software and the business informatics guys who uh, focus much more on analysis and a little bit of design. So they focus on what is the future software meant for, so what shall I do later on? And the business informatics person would uh, analyze the needs of a company, would find out what measures would be necessary for the company to be implemented, for example, to go for data privacy. Whereas the software engineer then would focus on implementing those measures and perhaps monitoring whether everything in the IT runs smoothly or whether some hack has already taken place. If I go over to the example in data science AI, the business informatics um, specialist would, for example, analyze all the data that a company has and would find out which data are appropriate to be analyzed and would perhaps decide on whether statistical methods are better or machine learning or other AI uh, measures. And then the software engineer would indeed implement the uh, analysis of the data and perhaps the making any conclusions from the data that has been analyzed with either machine learning or AI or data science methods. The characteristics of our program are quite simple. First of all, we are quite practice oriented. So we work in projects and project is daily life of any informatics person. Then we work in small groups. We work in a way that we know each other so it's not all only work and study related. We even drink a cup of coffee together, or whatever. So we know each other and talk with each other in general. We do two internships during your four year bachelor program. So at the end, you already, uh, already have been 10 months in a company, which is quite nice. Then you already have experience how business life works. Another point is that we work quite project oriented. So in every semester, you work on a project in a small group of four to five uh, students and you work on the project from the very beginning to the last day of the semester. We are international from the very beginning, so we have roughly about 40% of our students are international, so you study in an international atmosphere from the very beginning. My name is Karl, I'm from Germany. I study business informatics in the second year, so the fourth semester. So I chose uh, Fontys Fenlo because I wanted to study in an international setting and uh, on English as well. So uh, Fontys was quite a good fit for that. I really like that uh, Fontys has a very practical approach and it's not as theoretical as um, most other universities. The structure of our program is um, if you start with the foundation phase for both the software engineer and the business informatics people. So you have to learn basics of what software development means, what a project is like, how you work together, how you program, how you do analysis of needs. So that is foundation of three semesters. And then you can decide, okay, I would like to go into the business informatics direction or software engineering direction. And even then, within those two, you can decide, okay, I want to focus on security, I want to focus on data science AI, I want to focus on uh, embedded, on Internet of Things, or on more classical software engineering or more classical business informatics topics. 
the jobs after your graduation are so manifold. You can do so many different things. You can become a software engineer in a consulting company. You can become a security specialist for a government or for a bank. You can become data science specialist for an insurance company. You can do embedded things in the car industry. There are so many examples. You can become a classical business analyst uh, as a business informatics person. I chose this study program because I wanted to do something with technology, um, but I also wanted to do something with business, and it combines the two, so it's uh, a nice fit. IT nowadays is overall, you can't even get up without IT, you can't even go to bed without IT. Business without IT is almost unthinkable nowadays, and still there is so much need for highly developed, highly qualified business IT people and software engineers to go the next steps.